Fit and Nation, it is day number 51 of the challenge, and you're probably all wondering what is going on with the uh, with the classes. Um, of course, if you don't already know, they are cancelled for this week, unfortunately. I really do apologize for that. Um, it's just, you know, we fall into that fitness class category, so... Um, Gyms are allowed to be open. You are allowed to do individual workouts. So um, for this week at least, you uh, you have the chance to come into the studio. Um, I basically set up 17 different appointment times during the day where um, I can have in uh, up to five people at a time. And you can come in and you can do your workouts. So the first time starts at 3.30 a.m. And it, it basically it runs every uh, 75 minutes. So you have one hour and then there's a 15 minute buffer. Okay, um, so when you come in, I'm just gonna ask that you put your belongings at one of the cages. I'm gonna mark off each cage uh, with some uh, green tape. Uh, essentially what I want you guys to do is to use the end cages, okay? And then there'll be one cage at the back that you can use, okay? That will be the five cages. So the the two end cages on either sides of the of the row of cages in the main floor, and then on the overflow side, uh, we'll set up one station there, okay? And this is just, you know, I could put in more people, I'm sure it would be okay, but I just, I'm just taking extra precaution. I figure if you guys are, you know, more separated, it's, it's even better. Now, some of you don't have a fob. Well, I guess the, probably the majority don't, don't have a fob. If, you're not a, if you weren't a member at our gym previously, you don't have a fob um, to get into the studio. So I'm going to have to give that to you tomorrow. So basically what I'll do is I'll be there in the morning from basically 5 a.m. till um, 7.30 a.m. I'll step out for an hour and I'll be back uh, from 8.30 until, um, let's say, 10.30. Um, so if you can make it during that time to come get a fob, please do so. Um, if you're going to come during that hour that I'm not there, then um, I'll just leave your fob for you um, on, the, on the counter. Okay, so just let me know. Um, if you can't make it tomorrow, then, you know, I, I obviously I'll be back. So uh, just let me know and I'll set up another time. Um, it would be good to get, a, uh, to get you know, the majority of you, if not all of you, done in a chunk of time when I'm there. And just get it done with, okay? Um, so this fob will allow you entry to the gym at... Uh, at basically any point in the day, okay? But you've got to log or you've got to reserve a class uh, uh, using Zen Planner. Do not use Calendly. Uh, Calendly has been disabled. Just use Zen Planner to book your times in, okay? Um, all right, so I wanna remind you guys, obviously, that this whole process of what we're doing in the challenge is a long-term endeavor. Really what the 10 weeks is, is just a taste of really what I want you to do for, you know, the ongoing you know, rest of your life, essentially. Obviously, I'm a little more aggressive in terms of how much I scale back the calories, which actually isn't even that much, it isn't, isn't even really that aggressive. About, um, for the majority of you, about a 15% decrease. Um, and uh, from start to finish, not much. And, uh, and obviously, your calories are still pretty high, right? So the idea here is that you will continue to eat a relatively high protein diet. Well, the protein amount that I give you would be considered high um, relative to what most people eat. Um, and then, of course, that we still keep your calories overall at a reasonable level. So we want to keep a, a decent amount of fat and carbohydrates in there. Um, I think I mentioned yesterday around week five levels would be would be more than you know sufficient just to just to keep as sort of a baseline. Um, and then you could make maybe a small deficit from there, or maybe a small surplus depending on how you feel and depending on what you're looking for, okay? Um, but a, as a guideline, that would be uh, a great starting point. Remember, it's about being reasonable and consistent over a very long period of time. And of course, we want to keep in there uh, weight training and, uh, and then some cardiovascular slash NEAT, right? Some non-exercise activity as well, okay? But you've got to really keep up with your three days a week of weight training. I can't stress that enough, okay? Uh, all right, so let's talk about a few supplements here um, just quickly. I'm going to go through some more over the next couple days. Um, I know I've talked about this before, but I want to remind you guys, especially during the time of COVID, that uh, glutamine is a great supplement for you for you to use. Glutamine is basically an, a foundational um, component to uh, erythrocytes, right, which is basically your, your, white, your, your white blood cells. Um, and... Um, 
This one here is obviously pharmaceutical grade. Uh, it's a very cheap supplement, by the way. I think we sell these for 500 grams. We sell for, I think, $30. And um, so it's very, very, it's a, it's a very good value. Very good value for what you get. Um, I should also remind you that this is actually fermented l -glutamine, which means it's that much more bioavailable. Okay. Um, so I'm going to highly recommend this. Another one that I'm going to recommend, which I don't carry, um, is a fish oil. I know I've talked about this before. The good thing about the fish oil that that um, that Costco has is that um, this version here is a super concentrate, so you've got a high level of EPA and DHA per capsule. Also, this is um, this fish oil is coming from anchovy, sardine, and mackerel. So these are small fish, and uh, obviously they're going to be much much lower. Um, hopefully, really have no uh, levels of um, of heavy metals that we see in the in the larger fish, right? Because these are very, very, very small fish. Okay, so it should be really, really safe to have, this should be the best oil that you can get really in terms of getting uh, omega-3 supplementation. Um, reminder, you cannot get the, we just don't have the enzymes to get at the EPA and the DHA that's in uh, plant sources of um, omega-3. So um, this is a great supplement to have. Um, as uh, as part of your uh, regime, okay. Uh, honestly, just a three a day would be would be a great uh, starting point. Okay, let's get to the message of the day. I'm doing good for time here. Message for day fifty one: Change the way you look at things, and the things you look at change. Perspective, perspective is everything. You know, you can compare yourself to people who have more than you which in the grand scheme of things is not that many people, relative to the amount of people that have less than you. Okay, so, um, you know, again, just, it's, it's just how you want, how you choose to look at things. You can look at how, you know, people lived for pretty much the entire history relative to, to how you live today. How much better do we have it today? We have it better than ever. Right, so sometimes, and I know what happens to all of us. Maybe we feel sorry for ourselves. Maybe we feel like our our life is rough. Maybe if you know you feel like you work a lot or whatever. But the reality is, is we've never had it easier. It's never been better. Um, so, and you know this uh, you, you, this whole idea of perspective change can be applied to so many aspects uh, of your life. Okay. This whole thing with the classes uh, being canceled right now, this is just a this is just a little blip. We the classes will get back and running. Uh, hopefully, uh, we will get the okay from um, a medical officer or, or uh, WorkSafe BC. I'm not sure who we have to go through exactly at this point, but and uh, we'll get the classes back up and running because I think that these classes are the way we have them structured should be should be safe and okay considering gyms get to stay open, okay? But coming back to the mess of the day, change the way you look at things and the things you look at change, all right? Always think of, always think about how lucky you are. Always think about, you know, um, always put things into perspective, right? Like, you know, we we often get frustrated or upset over the over things that really, really don't really have that much of a consequence in our lives if any consequence at all, right? So keep this in mind. Always ask yourself, you know, um, is it, you know, is, am I losing my house, right? Am I dying? Um, you know, is is what I'm upset about really having a, 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 a huge effect in my life? Really, is it, okay? Or maybe it's just having an effect on, you know, my train of thought, okay? Your train of thought, you can always change. So keep that in mind, you guys. Change the way you look at things and, the, and the things you look at change, okay? I will talk to you all very soon. Positive energy, positive vibes. Believe in yourself for the love of God. Give some gratitude, and I'll talk to you all soon. See ya. Don't forget, book in your time on Zen Planner, okay? Go to your Zen Planner app. Book in three uh, sessions, three hours per week for you to get your uh, workouts in, okay? Same rules apply. You can book up to eight days in advance, okay? Talk to you all soon. See you guys.